Hi everybody, it's Zelda with Real Estate Talk. And today I have with me Vara. Vara is the owner of My Maids. And we're going to talk to her about some tips you can get for when you are ready to clean that house. And let's face it, the holidays are fast approaching. We're gonna have family and friends all visiting us. So we wanna clean house. So welcome to the show, Vara. Thank you for having me, Zelda. So tell us, how did you get started with My Maids? Oh, it's four years back. I was a customer for six years, actually, to be very honest. The company has been in existence for 32 years. Okay. And uh, for six years back, um, I, I signed up with my maids mm -hmm. and uh, I ended up buying the company when it was up for sale, when the owner was retiring. I never knew it was my maids and just got into it and uh, acquired it. Is my, is my maids, is it a franchise? It is not. It's, it's not, not a privately franchise. owned. So business. you say it's a friendly business, which is awesome. So tell me a little bit about the culture. The culture is, it's an all women workforce. Okay. So, you know, hello to women. <laughs> so they have, we have our own issues and we treat, we want to treat others like how we want to be treated. Mm -hmm. So we, we just, um, it's a family culture. Basically we treat women like, uh, we bring them back from work if they have issues with the kids. And we have baby showers, Christmas parties, bonuses, and uh, it, it's a very friendly environment. Treat the employees right, and mm -hmm. you will make them shine through for the customers. I noticed that when I came here, you had two um, two people up front in the lobby, right. and they were so friendly. So I'm assuming you have very quick uh, response time? Oh yes, definitely. Sometimes on the same day, we sign up customers on the same day, the schedule allows. And we have five to six teams all around Jacksonville. Okay. So if we have any cancellations or they finish work early, we can put you on the same day schedule. So you mentioned that they were in Jacksonville. Tell us the areas that you service. We uh, cover entire Clay County since we are located in Orange Park. And we go all the way all over to all County and St. John's all the way to World Golf Village. And even proper St. Augustine now, we've started sending teams okay. out there. Have you been? Have you come out to Nocatee? Oh yes, we have customers in Nocatee as well. Okay, great. On so, Vidra and Nocatee, yes. Great, so we're out in Nocatee, and tell me a little bit about how you define success. Um, success for me is harmony with your thoughts, desires, and your goals. Mm -hmm. Person, personally, you have to strike a balance, um, and that's what defines success for me with your family, your um, vision, your career and uh, balancing everything out and finding peace within yourself i think that's what is yeah, success absolutely so while you're out there working hard to do all this i'm imagining you've had some strange requests before <laughs> oh, tell yes. us about those requests <laughs> we've gone through doggy doors let me tell you that much <laughs> that's amazing you had to go through a doggy door. why did you have to go through a doggy door uh, because the customer forgot to leave a key oh. and she had to have her home clean that day so they, she requested can you please Make sure somebody goes through the doggy door, opens the door, and have the home clean. I'm hoping it was a, I'm imagining nobody could fit through my doggy door. It's like this little, even my dogs don't like it. But right. wow. so we've, we've what, what, other, what other kinds of things have they requested? Probably measured the sheets with a ruler to make sure it's even on both sides. Oh, wow. We change sheets. OCD. <laughs> <laughs> and use toilet brush on stains on the floor. That was a little weird request. Yeah, and, uh, yeah. Okay. We have... Um, you know, some customers with certain you know requests like coffee filters had to be turned this way and and emptied this way and you know there's little things and don't touch this and and clean the you know the so I'm gonna, you said don't touch this and don't touch that so I'm assuming y'all are insured yes we are insured bonded and uh, all our employees are background screened screened and uh, we use eco friendly products. That's good. Now, do they ever ask you if you if you're using your products or can you use my products or how does that work? Oh yeah, our customers. We we uh, we are very flexible. Our customers come first, and whatever they need, and we accommodate their requests. We uh, if they want to use their own products, we are more. So, more what than does your cleaning include? What do y'all clean? Uh, we pretty much cover from every every angle of your house is covered. You know, starting from ceiling fans, mini blinds, your baseboards and all your bathrooms will get cleaned, your tubs, your kitchen counter, and uh, the floors will get mopped, vacuumed, dusted, and pretty much we polish all the furniture and, um, and the towels. And we have, if you have fresh linen or fresh sheets, we change the sheets and then um, we um, fold your club, um, towels and um, pretty much the whole house gets cleaned. That's awesome. In and out and we deodorize the house, deodorant, you know, the house is all smelling good. 
So that's to me the best part is <laughs> after uh, the cleaning service has left and you walk in, oh, that smell of a clean house is just yes. so awesome. Yes, we pretty much. It gives you peace of mind for women, especially. Yes. One less thing to worry about. We have enough things on our plate already. So when you come home to a clean home, it's just it takes the stress out of you. Tell so, me a little bit more about the products that you use. We use green cleaning products, starting from the rags we wash. We mm -hmm. use only eco-friendly products. And um, it's just um, nothing um, that is harsh or environmentally not friendly. We do not. So if there, somebody's got pets in the house, they don't need to worry about the chemicals that no, you're using? No, not at all. That's at good all. to know. Mm -hmm. So tell me a little bit about if somebody want. do you have some, I get a lot of people that want to know tips. Mm -hmm. So tell us, a, a, give us a good tip for people who, if they're not like, well, like me, I'm going to clean my house before the cleaning service comes. I have a feeling I'm not the only one who does that. So give us a tip to help you guys when you arrive. Pretty much organizing, you know, all the things, just not clutter, declutter it a little bit so that our girls can come and do their job. And, you know, just the clothes, if it's, you know, just put it in a kind of don't lay it around. So just make sure you don't want to pick up our clothes. <laughs> <laughs> it just wastes our time yeah. picking up stuff. Uh huh. Sure. Instead of cleaning, you know, sure. like books or clothes or any uh, trash line. I mean, the trash I like. I liked what you were telling me earlier about just moving books and magazines around. Tell us a little bit about why that's important. That's important because we dust everything. So if it's spread out, it's harder for us to get the dust out of the way. So it's you know toys, clothes, books or any pots and pans just lying around all over the place it takes us more time and it's harder for us to get all the dust out of it. I would think so, that also just by moving, decluttering and organizing and moving things around, you're going to discover that, gee, there's some dust behind there that you didn't know was there before because you never moved those magazines. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. So just organizing a little bit. We're not asking you to clean the whole house up before we come. We, we are there to straighten do that. Up. Just straighten, straighten up. up a little bit. There you go. Straighten up is the <laughs> biggest tip of how you can save them time and save you money, basically. So do you have specials for new customers? Oh, yes. We always have specials on our website. You can check us out, mymaidscleaning.com. And we offer $35 off first and second cleaning. First so, and second cleaning. Yes. That's pretty cool. Yes. Okay. And we have uh, two-hour specials going on for 280 and 199 You can check our website. And we have okay. specials for fall and uh, for Christmas. Okay. So those are always so, changing constantly. So you got to. So you've got to check the website to find out what the newest specials are. She does come out to Nakati, which is very important for my Nakati listeners. And tell us how to reach you. It's easiest way to call us. We pick up the phone. In nine to five, we are there, and we pick up the phone. Not like other companies. And the phone number is two six four. 6666. Six, six, six. Easy to remember. 264 6666. 6666. Very easy. Well, that's the show for today. Uh, thank you, Vara, for sharing these great um, tips and information about uh, my maids. So, if you're looking for a fantastic service, give them a call, give them a shout out, and hey, tell them Zelda sent you. Yeah. Till next time, this is Real Estate Talk with Zelda.